Hello everyone, I'm making this video to help anyone who's facing the same issue with Maxima. I think this is happening for Maximas from 2008 to 2014. So today morning I just came to start up my car and this is what happened. It's stuck on lock and whenever I push the start button it will stay the same. So, many people told me and I read on the internet that I have to remove this piece of plastic. It's just very easy. You can find it online. And this piece, what they call it, the ECM I think or something like that, it will be stuck inside here. Not stuck, it will be fixed here inside like this if you see it they will tell you to tap on it with a hammer or something and they will tell you to try to push the start button while you are tapping with the hammer so by luck maybe the car will start i did that and it didn't work for me so what i did if you see here you will find two screws like this I don't know it if you look here you can see this screw You'll bo you will find two screws just remove them <clears throat> and take this it will be easy to remove the screws can be removed by hand it's very easy so don't worry you don't need anything special if you see this is the screw you you will not find I think a tool to remove it but by hand it's very easy for me it was very easy to remove it by hand when you remove the screw you will get this piece of shit out and you see there is some some kind of lock mechanism you see this lock you can push it inside so what you will do to start the car you will push with something if you have a screwdriver or something there's just push it fully inside and then you can start the car. I will show you. Like this. If you see, I'll hold it don't know how to fix the camera but if you see like this I'll get the screw I'll push here fully inside and then I'll start the car see such an easy fix don't lose your money on uh, and take it to the dealer i think i removed the fuse before the 10 ampere fuse but still the problem is happening to me i don't know maybe i done it wrong but if they are if you check the internet they are telling you if you remove the 10 ampere fuse which is located there outside this issue won't happen again but for me it's kept happening so i removed this and i don't know what i will do i will find the solution to keep the lock inside. Have a good day everyone.